Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Now in today's video, we have here the Huawei MatePad 11, but not just any MatePad 11. This is actually the Paper Matte Edition. Now what this means is if you look closer, you will see that we have here a very frosted matte glass panel and of course there's no glare whatsoever so in today's video we're going to find out like how this display is going to help us in our viewing experience we're going to talk a bit about drawing and sketching so if you are the kind of creative person you might want to check that out as well and last but not least we'll talk a bit about a very quick review of what this device and how it performs like let's begin the video right away now first and foremost i think we should clear off the big elephant in the room and you know like what's the difference between a glass panel like this and a typical matte screen protector now if you have been in the market looking for a matte screen protector you will notice that a typical one comes with a lot of graining there's a lot of noise on the screen itself and it comes with to a certain extent a bit of a rainbow effect now you can find none of those here with this paper matte display because it is made to be so smooth and if you just take a look at it close up you know super up close and personal you will notice that it's like a HD version but it's completely matte so I think that's great about this paper matte you know display at the front here because it gives you a lot of new possibilities with it now let's bring up the topic about the viewing experience because I think this is super important for this particular tablet now let's say you are a student or if you just read a lot of ebooks you know like magazines or even the news or any browsing of websites online you will notice that with a display like this there is no glare whatsoever and just imagine this guys it doesn't matter if you are outdoors or indoors most of the time when there is a light source pointed at your tablet you will notice that it usually reflects back that kind of light however with this paper matte display over here you will only see a very soft glow and you will still be able to see the content very clearly on the tablet itself so I think that's the huge difference here because just reading content browsing content especially your comics and all that is going to be so much more easier on the eyes with this Huawei MatePad 11 Paper Matte Edition. Now just so you know this is also the first tablet to be the one to get the SGS Low Visual Fatigue Premium Performance Certification and it's also the first ever TUV Rhineland Reflection Free Certified Tablet. So at the end of the day you will be protecting your eyes if you use this kind of display. Alright, so moving on to the second aspect about this display, I want to talk a bit about the drawing, sketching, or even writing notes. Well, the good news here is that with this paper matte edition, Huawei is actually throwing in a free smart keyboard case together. It also comes with a free M pencil. And last but not least, you get this really nice uh, polishing or cleaning cloth, if you want to call that, it's microfiber. So it's a very good cloth to remove all kinds of dust, dirt, and smudges on the display itself. So again, fantastic package because everything is all in the box. You do not have to buy any Anything separately. Alright, so back to the drawing or sketching experience. First and foremost, I want to say that writing on this has been really, really smooth. You can see that there is very minimal latency in the M pencil. Again, I'm just going to show you very close up. You can see that it's almost instant. Whenever the M pencil touches the display, it writes off almost instantly. So that's great because the writing experience is very natural. Now, in terms of drawing and sketching, again, this is where the low latency of the M pencil really helps out. But I think the key point here is all about that palm rejection. A lot of uh, drawers or creative individuals always are very concerned about that palm rejection and no matter how hard I try to intentionally create a palm you know like mark on the display itself I found that I could never do so and it always gets removed so you don't have to worry about your palm pressing on the display when you are just writing drawing or sketching it will be very strong at rejecting all those palm detections so that pretty much sums up the drawing and sketching experience I think this is actually great for students if you are in your lecture halls you want to jot down a couple of notes very quickly or you know draw graphs or just draw some tables or whatever on the display you will be able to do it in a very natural manner Manner, just as if you were writing it on a piece of paper. Now before we end, it's also worth mentioning that this tablet is powered by the Snapdragon 870. That means your productivity will be good enough to use for most of its apps. We also have the PC-like experience on here as well. That means that you can use WPS to you know, write, edit, you know, do all your documents, PowerPoints and all that directly on the tablet itself. And my favorite thing is actually the super device collaboration that like you can see here. I've actually got my smartphone connected. It's right at the corner. You can see I'm just, I can just glide over my smartphone. And I think this particular feature is very important because you can control, remotely control your smartphone directly on your tablet itself. You can transfer files directly from your phone to the tablet. And again, this helps you to put files on your phone directly onto your notes or presentation or whatever that you're doing instantly. It's so seamless and easy. So that's all about that super device stuff. Anyways, uh, I think that pretty much sums up my very quick take on the Huawei MatePad 11 Paper Matte Edition. If you are in the market 
looking for a tablet that comes with one of the best displays. It protects your eyes, it gives you an even better writing, drawing, sketching experience, better reading experience as well. I think the paper matte edition of the Mate Pad 11 is definitely something that you should check out. Again, don't forget that Huawei is throwing in the smart keyboard, the M pencil, and of course the cleaning cloth all together in the package. So it's a very complete package for just about RM2299. Anyways, if you have any further questions about this particular device, feel free to drop a comment down below. I'll try my best to help you guys out. Again, thank you for watching today's video all the way till the end. Don't forget to drop a like and sub to the channel if you want to see more content like this. And I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. Do take care and stay safe. Bye-bye.